while hundreds of plungers prepare to jump into White Bear Lake on a day barely breaking single digits. Not even cold today. White Bear Lake reservist Jim Kvitrud has been on the clock for hours, directing traffic in the bitter cold. Sometimes you have to wing it. He's among dozens of reservists from Metro agencies dispatched to work the event. And though attendance is down due to the cold... Sir, go ahead. His sense of humor seems to have hit a high note. Well, I was, I was kid in the reserves. They started full pay. <laughs> But then my other joke is we get double time after midnight and double time when it's below zero. I'm 85% Norwegian <laughs> and, re and, the, and the rest is Scandinavian. Kvitrud's passion for service, he says, comes from his parents, a commitment to community he's passed on to his own children. I feel rewarded, but I also feel like I'm doing a good job for the community. And my coworkers are my brothers and sisters, it really is. It's a family, I didn't realize that initially. Love of service is the sentiment echoed among many reservists, including Justin Van Hallinger. Are you going to drive under the ice or no? He's been a Cottage Grove reserve for nine years and worked the Wiper Lake Plunge for the last six. I mean, time flies when you're having fun, so I enjoy doing this. Like I said, I've been doing this nine years. I love what I do as a reserve. I love giving back to our community and helping out with other communities as well. The reserves, who are focused on their task at hand, say they pay little attention to what's happening lakeside, content to direct cars and plungers where to go. Hi there. Are you going to go in the lake too? <laughs> she wishes she could go with her parents, but... And doing it with a smile. You just try to be nice about it because treat others like you want to get treated. <laughs>